Hey, I've only got to the NCAA college basketball part. Number two. And I'm probably going to see this game, Michigan and Wisconsin. Oh, wait. Michigan and Wisconsin. Oh, I did that, but I guess I didn't. Uh, Wisconsin actually won that. Oh, yeah, this was Um, they leave you. Uh, Michigan took a L against the Wisconsin Badgers. You say Wisconsin, but I don't think Wisconsin. I thought I did this game, but I don't know. 100% attendance, Badgers won 86-78. Badgers are 2-1, Michigan is 0-2. Was there another game with that? Oh, there wasn't. I don't know. Uh, yeah. And I'm going to do the Marquette game. So, yeah. Alright, both teams are 0-1. Uh, Gold Eagles lost to Wisconsin. Miami is 0-1. I don't know who they lost to, but they have Ronald Samson, actually, Mann, Martin, Benjamin, Tommy Wilcox, Derek Olson, Marcus Howard, Jeffrey Elson, Ben McLeod, Jamal Blackman, and Rizzi Smoothie, and Marquette. Yeah, let's get right into it. All right, boys. Here in Miami. Not in Marquette, sadly. Yeah, we get it. You're gonna see a wild Marcus Howard in action, boys. 100% attendance, maybe 97%. We're going here in Miami. Marquette versus Miami. Marquette Gold Eagles and Miami Hurricanes. McLeod. Eyes into Howard. Howard, he's really? gonna take the shot from deep. Oh, that actually almost went in. Alright, guys. Marquette's up 32 26 second quarter. And also, the YBA, I'm gonna put it to 12 minute quarters. Because the virtual fans, fans don't like it. They want longer games. So, yeah. Marquette currently up. Miami's inside of Wellington. He gets it. Third quarter. Marquette up 70 to 63 against Miami. Both teams have a bonus, so that's pretty, pretty surprising. But hey, can't complain, I guess. Flores, Flores, where you shoot? Where you shoot, buddy? Castro doesn't hit it. Oh, and one. There's like a uh, <laughs> growl. <laughs> and he misses. And there's a minute and a half left. Marquette's. They have a five point lead. Marcus Howard at the line. Come on. Marcus Howard had drained the first one. Marcus Howard will drain the second one, and that should put the game away. Guys, this thing is a four-point game, and there's going to intentionally fall, but this game is still to be over. Good run by Miami coming back a little bit, but not enough. And Marquette's gonna take their first double season. Miami's gonna go two and zero. Oh. Hundred four ninety eight. Hundred four ninety eight. And time out, Miami. Player of the game, Marcus Howard. Stone Cold. Marcus Howard points up deep. I'm pretty sure he's in the 2020 draft class. If he's not, then I'll put him in next year. Personal foul. And he drains the second one. That should put the game away. Three by Miami misses. That should do it. Will they foul? They're not trying to even try. There's not even any point. They're down by eight. Not care about. Marquette with the easy dub at on the road. Uh, Barry 
Saunders had 26 points. Mark Tower, 19 points. He had double double, 50 rebounds. Uh, Jeffrey Isley, 17 points. 13 points. 13. Dang, you know, so. But Ronald Sampson, he had the most points out of everybody. Including, and plus Marquette players. He had 22 points. Horse Griffin, Blake Griffin. <laughs> yeah. Alright, gonna see another game. Oregon took a, or Texas took a fat, fat L. Oregon, that he had like, they had like half Oregon's points. 15 points for Ducks, 13 points, and most on the Longhorns at 10. So, Ducks saw the first game, they're, on, they're 1 0. And for the Texas, that was the first game, they're on 1. And we see Marquette, and that was a 100% tennis, 100% tennis for Mar- Marquette. And, uh, oh yeah, Miami game. There's not even a logo for Miami. That's pretty sad. There's not even a logo for Miami. That's pretty sad. Tennessee beat Kentucky. I mean, they're actually a good team, though. 45-37. That was Kentucky's first game of the year. They're 0-1 and ten- for Tennessee. They're 2-1. Um, Michigan State beat Oklahoma State by four, six points. 58-52. to 52, 93% attendance. That was Michigan State's first game. They're one zero, and for Oklahoma State, they're one and two, and they're hundred percent attendance at the Kentucky and Tennessee game. And Xavier took an L to Gonzaga. To Gonzaga, who Gonzaga is actually pretty good, and in real life too. Gonzaga won 51-44. Gonzaga, Gonzaga. I usually call it Gonzaga. Some people call it Gonzaga. I'm say that. So I love you, y'all. Go in the comments and diss me, but I'm gonna z- z- I go on 27 54 against Xavier. Xavier, that was their first game, their own one, and Gonzaga, their own two. And I'll probably simulate that game. Let's see, one. Oh, that's Miami, Texas Tech. Miami had two in a row. They actually went into overtime, and Miami took a dub. It was tied 52 52. Miami had eight points, and Texas Tech didn't even score in overtime. So they, so Miami won 60 to 52. Attendance 100%. That was Miami's first win of the year. Miami is one and two, and Texas Tech is going two. Uh, let's see this. I'll probably simulate this day too. Not many games. Alright, let's see. Indiana lost to Virginia 44-41, for attendance. That's a pretty close game. Tied in the fourth quarter. Indiana's 1-1, and that was Virginia's first game, so they're 1-0. For Oregon, they took a fat dub. Memphis took a fat L. Only 60% attendance in Memphis. <coughs> I think <coughs> COVID got I have COVID. Oregon won 53-52 by... 19 points. Oregon, 2 0. And for Memphis, they're 1 1. So, yeah, no games. December 17th. Free game there. So I'll probably simulate this day too. I'll probably do some of my teams. I'll do that game, I guess. Unless there's a bunch of games. I'll, I'll go to one of these games, alright? I'll go to the. Arkansas and Ellis, you want to see that. But, yeah. Um, Oregon took, Michigan State took a fat, fat L. They lost by 30 points. Oregon won 70 to 40, 81% attendance. Oregon is 3 0. Michigan is 1 1. Oregon's actually pretty good, though. Pretty solid. Arkansas took a fat L to Baylor. Baylor, Baylor, Bears. 100% attendance. I'll probably change that. 6445 because you know downloadable things is not always right, but um six four to forty five. Arkansas is 0 two, they have that was second game. Baylor's one and one. And that was Arkansas and Baylor. Second game of the year. USC beat Memphis fifty seven forty two. USC is two and zero, and Memphis is one and two. That has sixty percent attendance. Man, Memphis fans, not many Memphis fans. I wanna go to a Memphis game. It'd be kind of cool to go in real life too, though. Uh, I want to go to one and two K. See that? 
at home. Honestly, that who to pull for? And yeah, I see by the record, Florida State took a fat L against Auburn. My 100% attendance in Auburn. 66-37, Auburn Tigers beat the Florida State Seminoles. Florida State's 0-2 and Auburn's 2-0. Oh, Florida State's not going to be that good, but... Well, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go to the Arkansas... This is going to be LSU's first game, too, so... Yeah, um... This will be in LSU. Joseph Valentine, Curtis Cotton, Randy Singleton, Wells Best, Jake West, and for Arkansas, Monte Baldwin, Jamal Ryan, Daryl Dixon, Reggie Bishop, Bishop, and Nick Christie. Whatever those people are. So yeah, let's get right into it. All right, boys. LSU first. LSU opening game for the night. Their court's actually pretty cool, though. I know they're mostly a football team, but LSU is actually pretty decent. In here, Arkansas going to kind of first win of the year. Home court advantage for LSU, C minus. I know they just won. Why does it have a Lakers logo? I don't know, but we're underway. LSU versus Arkansas Razorbacks. Three ball does not hit it. Cotton to the inside. Oh, almost inside. Valentine. Step back. Now it's going to rip out. Second quarter. And Arkansas is Arkansas Razorbacks blowing out LSU. Is this a point for LSU that they're not going to be such a good team? They're not that good of a team? I don't know. They might not be that good of a team. Step back. Oh, I thought it was going to step back. West gets blocked. Back to Valentine. Back to Best. Cotton going inside. Almost Valentine on the outside. Singleton driving. Shot clock. Got it. If you guys don't know my face franchise video, LSU, the college I went to. So, oh, LSU actually came back to shoot free throws. And with my face franchise video, I plan on doing some soon. To a break break of a 2K. And the divisional tournament, which I haven't done in a while either, but I'm doing like a franchise off camera on that, and I've been playing a little bit with 2K, but that's lost. And yeah, guys, a minute four, a minute fifteen, it's all tied up. LSU has came back from like the second, the first half, but they've been coming back. They have down like six in the third quarter, but here. They are for the lead. What the? F he freaking cut out the shot. I didn't see it go in, but I guess it did. What a <laughs> goal! And it is ninety to eighty-eight. Minute fifteen, boys. Arkansas. Will they come up clutch? Else using the bonus too, and Arkansas not both that one timeout for three. Does not hit it? Gets the offensive rebound. Ribs out. I wouldn't foul here if I was zero points in twenty three minutes for the Razorback. Zero. They definitely choked this. They they have not scored in twenty three minutes. That means they haven't scored since like mid third quarter. Like start of the third quarter, I think. Nixon for three misses. They cannot hit anything. LSU driving <clears throat> for three misses. Can Arkansas do something for three? Open. It rims out. Offensive rims out. Foul. He's going to need to make both of these. Exactly 20 seconds left. Coming up, coach. He misses. I mean, he's a center, I think, but still. All right, he's gonna definitely need to make this. He chokes. He missed both free throws. They don't need a foul now. Oh my gosh, that just might have done it. I mean, unless LSU chokes here, but I don't see that happening. First free throw is good. They're gonna need them to miss this one for a chance. 
Andrews, if he would not have been, he if he would have made at least one, they could have had a chance. But this game is now over. Here we go, boys. Jake West, player of the game. Dude, I got a poop so bad. Come on, get that game over with. Fraser Packs, Arkansas. Can they do something? They need to. They need to shoot. They need to shoot quick for three. Miss that almost went in, man. If, I say they're unlucky. I'd say Arkansas unlucky. They, they. I mean, they did choke, but they that that shot should went in. And the other three. It was like a minute left. This game's already over. I don't even know how we're watching it. I don't even know what I'm watching anymore. You miss everyone, it doesn't even matter. There you get a three off, like right now. Stop passing, stop passing. And that's game. GG, LSU wins their first game of the season. Well, guys, I'm going to go to, well, guys, I'm gonna go to December 20th, because that's where the YBA is right now. So, next up, we have Arkansas uh, against Tennessee. I'm um, probably going to send that, but. Let's look at the standings. Power rankings, Oregon. Wow. <laughs> yeah, they still have last year's. Er, well, this is 2019-2020 season. Nice. But they have NBA. I can't Oregon's 3-0. North Carolina's 2-0. Oregon, though. Wow. Tennessee's 2-1. Kansas, 1-0. Marquette's 1-1. One 1-2. One. Um, one, Duke is the 8th seed right now. Marquez just out at 500. Baylor, Illinois. Illinois hasn't even played yet. Any team that Florida State, no one, they're 0 oh 2, yeah. Arkansas, 0 oh 3 is the worst team right now. Auburn, 2 0. Oh. Gonzaga, 2 0. Oh. USC, 2 0. Oh. Wow. Virginia, 1 0. Oh. Wisconsin, 2 oh. 2. They played four games, though. Michigan State's the eighth seed right now. She is just out to Michigan team. Illinois is the only one to not play. When is Illinois' first game? Oh, it's December 23rd against Kentucky. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.